the name Vidyam? It's a Malayalam word and it means heart. So our heart is like it's the main part of our uh, body, and it's connected with everything. So it's the main living organ in our body. So Vidyam is like love. to make uh, all the spaces like just connected with the nature and should be having a uh, interaction with the family and everything so the site area is 15 cent so this is the site so we have access from this area so this is the main access of the site and we were having a existing uh, building which was our previous home so here is the uh, new site location behind the house so I have shown the site into three portions public semi-public and private so in the public area I have included like a sit-out area then in uh, semi-public area the living room and dining and everything is included and in the private area it's uh, the bedroom space and the toilet space we are sitting in the sit-out area actually this act as a sit-out for like a guest living the main idea was to accommodate more people in the sit-out area like my father and my family has many friends and they used to have a gathering space also this, this is a main family gathering space so i have made like an inbuilt kind of seating space as much as possible and it's a multifunctional space also well, Kerala is having an excessive rainfall so it will, uh, we have to consider more about the rainy season too so I have considered like the sit out area is having the sloping roof that is like the both side we can enjoy the rain that fall into the water body and from the water body the rain water is collected and it is purified and sent to that well and also uh, talking about the interior like uh, during the rainy time it will be like a darker shade so I have used more of warm light and also it is good to enjoy the rain from inside then after that we will be entering to the main living and dining area so this is our main living and dining area so to increase the uh, space quality and also to make it more spacious i have made the living and dining area into double height so that we will be having a good space quality and here is the compound wall and the green courtyard space so someone entering from the here will be getting a good uh, entry feeling so here is the kitchen space so the kitchen is having a good access from the dining area so from the dining area the staircase is connected to the top floor talking about the staircase i have built in such a way that it's kind of a two part it's a concrete one and also the second flight is of made up of wood and we are ending up to a bridge space this is a place in the first floor like the upper living space so i have provided a bay window Usually the bay window used to be like a square or rectangle that's right to the outside. So I want something different and uh, which shows some character to the house. So I have planned in such a way that it's a round and the round is much bigger so that we can have a good nap here. To emphasize this round window, I have colored a pop-up color like a uh, yellow color is done. Roofing is like the traditional one, like the upper one is the mangrove tile and in the ceiling, I have used the cement board. It is designed in such a way that the rafter is visible from the downstairs. And also uh, the clear story windows and for enough cross ventilation, I have placed in such a design. So that's how the roofing plays. And the right side, there is a bay window. Oh, that's a typical kind of bay window and have a in good enough character of the traditional architecture. And that's having a good view towards the, the central courtyard. Yeah, this is the bedroom in the first floor. Uh, it's my own bedroom. So the layout is in such a way that the bed is coming uh, next to the door. Study space is arranged. It's like a bay window. Then uh, old furniture and something is uh, arranged here. I have provided a uh, rustic window. 
so that's open up to the living and dining area for the sloping roof which is the south facing side so to reduce the heat reduction i have used the sloping roofs in this side and also the in the east the morning sun will be hitting on the white ceiling of the house and we will be getting a good amount of lighting in the main hall so this is the main living and dining area that's having a huge volume space actually i uh, i worked on the detailed windows like most of the windows are like uh, unique windows and also these two windows are provided for the uh, balancing of the houses actually uh, everyone like, was expecting like a typical kind of home i was very satisfied like how they use the spaces it's kind of like a, the older generation coming to the house they are just their lifestyle didn't break anywhere they are coming and having the seating so i didn't put any ornamentation or any proper kind of seating i have placed many seating wherever possible so everyone was using this space very genuinely like i could feel that how they the interaction happens how the interaction between the family and the friends happens so i was really happy i was more interested for the imperfect of the material so mainly i have used akamudi tile for the flooring and wood was used all the woods are used as a natural finish this is uh, the project which i did for my father after his retirement he would like to uh, enjoy his life peacefully pleasantly with the family his work style was stressful and like a sleepless night so i would like to make a good home home kind of feeling to him so he would have a good retirement life